What's up guys, this is Save Knight, and welcome back to Let's Play Ultima, Quest of the Avatar. I'm actually getting pretty close to the end now. Um, from here, I actually gated all the way to Scar Bray, got a pirate ship, and then sailed north and east into like a thing. If you look like where Scar Bray is at, northwest of here, you see that big long trench looking thing. Why, the end of it is the Dungeon Shame, which is the one for honor. Made my way through it, and it actually wasn't really that hard. You actually had to go from level 1 down to, what, 6 or 7, and then go across into a room, then go back up another staircase, back up to level 2, to get it. Uh, after getting the Purple Stone of Honor, I actually went back to Trinsic, because I realized I forgot to do something. There's a a locked gate in there, or a locked door, whatever you want to call it, with a guy inside that tells you the purple stone is in shame, so that was kind of a waste, but talking to him does bring up spirituality. Then, uh, from there, um, I went... I went to the pub, and someone said something about, like, like, you know, tip him well and he'll tell you something, so I tipped him, I think, like, 50. And then I had to tip him another 50, or you could just do 100 right off the bat. And he told me to go to Moonglow and talk to Basil, and he knows where to find Fungus. So I went to Moonglow, talked to Basil, the guy that said that he has a secret and wouldn't you like to know. Well, he finally told me that search at 149.46 on New Moons, which is actually somewhat northwestish of Trinsic, past the mountains and across a bridge, in like a forest. You search there into new moons and you actually acquire fungus. Wrong button. And I was like a really shitty fucking search. And that's the only place you could find fungus, so I went into doing that crap off screen, maybe. And then went to pause, picked up some more herbs, and then went to uh, pause. Nope. I'm sorry, went to pause to pick up some more herbs, and then went to Buccaneer's Den to pick up some more tools. Mostly just gems. Now, from here, I'm going to finish up with the last dungeon here Hithloth. I know that several people have told you. Actually, before I even do that, I'm actually going to go upstairs. Because I got that gate. That I couldn't get into. I think I talked to him already. Yeah. the castles of truth, love, and courage, and speak with all named Antos. I think I pretty much did already. Father Antos, Brother Antos, and Sister Antos. And before I do that, go do the ones upstairs. I mean, like, it fucking makes you talk to all of them, uh, because I'm still very well in spirituality. Ay ay ay. Have y'all ever struck an innocent? Like, no. I can still enjoy life. Eh. Thy virtue is not my concern. I did what I wanted to do, so leave me alone. Uh, okay. Not really sure how that brings up spirituality. And some guy just told you that he enjoys hitting people, and the other one said, What you do is none of your business, or what you do is none of my business, so piss off. Now I'm gonna start heading into the freaking dungeon. Uh, 
hit wall. Yeah. What the fuck is that supposed to be? Like a bookshelf or something? That guy said something about, like, you know, once you go in, you can't come back the same way you went in, or some kind of shit. He's actually on the first floor. But the way to actually do this is to come here. Cast. Exit. To leave. And then go back inside, which brings you back a completely different route. What you have to do is actually come here, do that fake wall, and into here. And this is where the stone would have been, but you've been told by many, many people it's not here anymore. My stone of spirituality is missing. And I think that kicks you back outside the normal way here and someone had actually told you well you actually think it was that chick that was um, right next to that fake wall in uh, Castle Britain that you walk through the global stairs that she said the hot the lighter than air device was stolen and taken to a remote location in the mountains or something like that and that's actually this and tra la 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 the uh, thing is, you have uncontrolled movement when in this, but you encounter no enemies. Apparently, you're floating too high up. No idea where the fuck I'm at right now. And the only way you can actually aim yourself is to cast wind and choose a direction. And when you choose a direction, it blows from that direction. So if I use a north wind, it blows from the north, which pushes me south. And, you know, so on and so forth for the other directions of the wind. You also get a full map of everything around you, including forests. Derp, derp, herpy, derp, derp. Go a little bit further down, and it will randomly change course. See, east wind. I probably would have been faster going the other way, but I don't really give a shit. Heading back towards Britain. Because if you remember, the ghost in the Scour Bray. Hi Cove. Bye Cove. The ghost in the... Where the hell was it? Scour Bray Inn. Told you that the White Stone of Spirituality is in a remote mountain location far beyond the reach of horses or men. Nope. Figure where the fuck I'm at now. I think I'm actually nearby, so let's get back at this. I think I go this way. And ooh, what is this? Here we have Serpent Spine Mountain. What thou dost find here, give it to Zircon of Minnick. And it sounds like a shrine. Let's run. Open the chest, you find Scale, which actually is the scale of Exodus. And you learn that Serpent Spine Mountain is actually the dead body of Exodus, I believe or is implied to be the remains of Exodus that have turned into a, um, like, I guess calcified into like a mountain or some shit, I don't fucking know. The abyss lies near the island of Verity to the south, its entrance ringed by the sea of fire. Only the one who hath mastered the eight virtues may enter. The age of darkness ended with the 
demise of Exodus yet, why doth evil still stalk the land? Because people are assholes, that's why. In the abyss, all eight stones are necessary. Indeed, the white stone is before the arc of this very cave. Open the box and take up the stone. I am the arc of the future. When thou dost look upon the codex, thou shalt know all. This journey is thy destiny. Go and seek the ultimate knowledge. Search. Shamanu, the stone of white. I now have all the stones. And now leave this place. Go to Minoc, as you said, give it to him. That scale. Okay, this episode's kinda more like a more or less a filler. Ah, let the skill of Exodus is recovered. For thee I shall fashion the acts of legend, for I have witnessed thy coming in my dreams. So if you have to leave, come back like a, a little later, I don't remember how long the cycle takes. So just give me a second. Okay, so it's a full moon. This is a twin full moon, so I'll just see. If that does it or not. Nope. Nope, you motherfucker. I'm actually going to make my way back to Britain. Yes, I know I left that hot air balloon thing there, but... I actually need to come back here. Go back into Hithloth. Since I now have all eight stones, I can hit up all three altars because all three of them connect to Hithloth. Dex and intelligence, but they cost 700 to do the thing, and um, I have 700 right now, so it would kill me outright if I tried to do the thing. So I can hit those two outright, and then I have to go up there, hit those two rooms to get to that one. Here we have the altar room of something. Altar room of love. Okay, so I love is yellow, green, orange, and white. You have the love key or the key of love, whatever. Yep, okay, truth is blue, green, purple, and white. Ah, 
Uh, I don't remember if I fought dragons yet or not. I'm pretty sure I did. But it's not that many, and this is really just like a filler, like I said. Jesus Christ, die. have them at the very end of the game. It's like the last thing, the absolute last thing you, like, do in the game is fucking that thing. The keys. Exit. He has enough to do the damn thing with the hot air balloon again, but... Spirituality as at the twin full moons. Moon gate at Minoc, so be right back. Okay, I'm back. I'm about to actually uh, gate there. Come on. And there we go. And Shrine of Spirituality. Cycle. Partial Avatar in the Virtue of Spirituality. One more left to go. I'm gonna gate back to Britain. Uh, 
Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and call it right here. When we come back, I'm going to uh, Magentia and recruit um, Catherine. Why well, not Catherine? Katrina. No, is it Catherine? No, it's Katrina. Yeah, it's Katrina. And then I went to look for the uh, thing of honesty, the rune of honesty. Then I'm gonna hit a shrine and then. Probably start doing like final prep stuff with getting items and things. So until next time, this is Save Night with Let's Play Ultima Quest of the Avatar. Later guys.